Hi, Carrie here. Hey, today we're going to talk about the neck. Um, one thing when you have teeth pulled for braces is everything becomes retractive. All train track braces have retractive forces. So when you remove teeth, you have no choice other than to move everything backwards. And what happens is a lot of times your lower teeth will get trapped behind your upper teeth. As pretty apparent, which you can see now with the setup with my orthotic where I'm at now. That's the ideal bite for me. Also, you can see that in front of my ears. Everything is lined up geometrically perfectly. And it's wonderful. But I still have the neck pain from my mandible being retracted. Um, what happens when you have teeth pulled for braces is when your lower jaw is brought back to get your teeth into that new position, most of the time your jaws don't fit together, but what happens is it makes your head actually 10 to 30 pounds heavier on your neck because your neck and your head are just not going to connect correctly. What a lot of people that have TMJ end up doing is leaning forward, kind of like hunched over like an ape. Um, that's very common. Also, there's one major TMJ trigger point on your neck. It's right here. It's, it's right where the neck and lower back connect. There's a lot of pain that can be generated right there due to the head becoming heavier than your neck is meant to support. I'm sorry, it was kind of bad wording there, but um, the other problem is when that happens, in my case, my neck actually develops scoliosis where it now bends to the left side. Also, what happens because of all the blockages is messages from my brain don't get delivered to other parts of my body. Like when I look at my fingertips, I can't, I can see what I'm doing, but it's total numbness from about here down I can't I can't feel what go, my fingertips at all so I could cut them with a knife cooking something and I wouldn't even feel it um, because the messages aren't getting delivered because of the bending and blockages in my neck due to my head being disproportionately heavy um, if anybody has any questions about the neck, just please feel free to let me know. Now that I have um, solved most of my TMJ pain, the neck is the only thing still bothering me. Um, I think it's because the bone is bent, and I don't know how that's going to ever be fixed, but there's a lot of t pain in that TMJ tension point in my neck. I don't, I don't have any pain in my head anymore, thank goodness. But um, I wanted to share this video on the neck because it's, a very, it's very important that everybody understands from that forward head posture caused from the jaw not being in the proper position, it causes the neck to have to compensate. And when it compensates, blockages begin and that tension point of pain just comes across fiercely. Okay, guys, have a great day. Thanks for watching. Aloha.